Yo, yo, YouTube. All right, so what you're looking at, this Stonehenge, of course. And this is from NASA. And look, don't beat me up about this. I'm not saying they're right. I'm not saying I agree. I'm just telling you what the satanic, occultic, black magic magicians are saying, okay? And NASA says that what they have found is what appears to be what looks like Stonehenge on Mars, okay? Yeah, it does look very similar. Now, I find this interesting because last night I'm, I'm watching the History Channel, and they have this stupid documentary called found, uh, Atlantis Found. And in it, they show a picture um, that they say that to that pervert Plato, um, the philosopher, that he depicted Atlantis like this. Very interesting. Looks all very much like the same thing to me. And then you go over here. There, there's many examples of this. This is just a quick one that I found. Here's this math.edu website all about Stonehenge. Okay. Um, planetary observations. And this is a book, you can find it on Amazon, this is a real book. M.W. Poston, has got to love that, so that's 33. He wrote a booklet entitled Stonehenge, Sun, Moon, Wandering Stars in 1982. Poston's built two scale models, which he called the Temple Model, Stonehenge 3, and the Enclosure Model, which shows outlying features such as the Aubrey Holes and Station Stones of Stonehenge 1 and 2. In his booklet, Poston states that the five trilithons represented the planets visible with the naked eye. So he goes on to say that he thinks this is all built based on the stars, and no surprise, surprise, as above, so below. But this is what we're interested in right down here. The Great Trilithon represented Saturn because Saturn moves very slowly across the sky compared to the other four planets. The stately pace may have indicated to the people who built Stonehenge that Saturn held some sort of senior position in the heavens. Because like everything else, this is just one big Saturn worship idol. You know, so I found that very interesting when they showed that picture that um, supposedly played out how he depicted Stonehenge. Just wanted to share it. Found it very interesting. Thank you to everybody for watching, and big thank you to my subscribers.